Once again, the America East Men's and Women's Basketball Tournament will share the same venue and the same weekend. Join your team at the 2012 America East Men's and Women's Basketball Championship presented by Newman's Own and hosted by the University of Hartford. For tickets, call 860-768-HAWK or visit AmericaEast.com. We're back here at the Track and Tennis Center at Boston University and America East on campus. And let's continue with our theme of unfinished business in basketball. For the Boston University women, they came up short in their bid on their home floor to win the America East Championship last season, losing to Hartford. Even though that was a heartbreaking loss, they've used that to motivate them this year. Really unselfish, you know, and I've been fortunate to coach a, a lot of unselfish teams here. There's a lot of good feeling around our program right now. People are there for each other. I mean, they created a poem themselves about trust and, you know, how we need each other. And they really, really genuinely like each other. Um, you know, they go home to each other's homes to, to be with their families, and so and it's easy for me to coach that. <laughs> It's a group that's played a lot of games together, and that mix of skill and experience has pushed the Terriers to the top of the standings. And maybe they're pushed by something else too. How last year ended with a loss in the title game on their home court. You know, sometimes you think about it as a senior, um, you know, going through those um, America East Championship games, and you know, you think about it, but Honestly, it doesn't matter anymore. What matters is now. And um, I think, you know, we're really focusing on that. And, you know, we're learning from the past, but um, we're always um, looking forward and uh, working really hard towards it. We just really want to play, like, our basketball, you know. Um, I mean, last year, like, you know, we lost in the championship. So uh, we just want to come out. We want to play our basketball and just go out there and win. Chantel Alford, the reigning player of the year in America East, has been her usual self on both ends of the floor. Chantel is an amazing player, but you know, an even better teammate, a better friend. Um, she's very soft-spoken, but when she does talk, everyone listens. And um, you know, she's she comes from a great family, and I think that you know that's how she wants to represent herself and BU. Alfred is far from alone on this team. A mix of established players and improved younger players make the Terriers the team to beat come tournament time. Everyone has to contribute, you know, um, to win games and we don't want just like one player doing all the work. Like we don't think like that. So it's just like, a, just like a team, you know, we all come together so we can win games. Their coach has high expectations and is a tough grader, but there's no arguing the midterm grade she gave her team. I'd give us an A. You know, we have great effort every single game. And right now, um, from our non-conference schedule till now, we really have figured out how to be more balanced. But it's the final exam that matters most, and the Terriers are working hard to keep that high grade. I, I think every BU team I've been on um, the past four years has been extremely unselfish. Um, uh, these, you know, my teammates are great. They don't care who gets the points, who gets the rebounds, who gets the steals. It's just as long as we get it, as long as we get them. Um, you know, it's always it's always been a team win um, under Coach Greenberg, and you know we really take a lot of pride in that. And you know, if Chantel has a, a great game one day, and Mo has a great game the next, and Rashida, you know, comes out firing, that's it doesn't matter. It's, as long as we get that W, everyone's happy. Still to come on America East on campus, recognizing success in the classroom, and a Hartford Hawk majoring in biomedical engineering, hoping to help others with a specific need in a war-torn country. My heart goes out to kids and the adults that lost limbs in the war, and that's something that I always wanted to do, is to go back and help them. America East is on the rise. We're on the move. We have so many strengths in this conference, from the students who are making a difference in their communities, to our alumni who are changing the world. Ultimately, we're about preparing young people for the rest of their lives. I'm very proud to say in America East, we do a great job. Every day, we're helping to create leaders. We've accomplished so much 
but we're just getting started.